welcome or welcome back and I need help at Cisco. In this example, we have a circle A and BC is the diameter, the radius is 12 cm and we need to find the, find the arc length of the uh, angles of the arcs given by the central angle that you see here. And I'm going to start with this angle DAB, which is 60 degrees. So the question, the first question is how much is this arc length? And the length of an arc or arc length is a fraction of the circumference. So the first thing you have to do is to find the circumference which we can use this formula since we know the radius 2 pi r and I'm gonna have 2 pi times radius of 12 that is 24 pi. Now we need to find as I said this uh, length and for that reason I'm looking to this 60 degree and I'm gonna try to make it faster instead of writing proportion. 60 de degree is 1 sixth of 360 and why do I do that? Because Whenever you have 360 degree, you have this circumference. So for finding the length of DB, you just have to divide this 24 pi by 6 or multiply by 1 6 since 60 degree is 1 6 of uh, 360. So that will be 4 pi. This is a faster way than uh, writing proportion when the angle are friendly. Let's go to the next angle, which is the angle EAB. EAB is this angle, which is 120. And 120 degrees is one third of 360 or 360 divided by three, if you want it that way. So the length of this arc Uh, BE, which goes with that uh, central angle EAB, will be 24 pi, the same circumference, divided by 3, so that will be 8 pi. And then let's move to the next one, which is angle EAF. EAF which is these angles of 30 degrees and I'm gonna go here on the right side and again 30 degrees is 1 12th of 360 degrees so basically from finding the length of this arc Fe we can do 360, uh, I'm sorry, 24 pi, in fact, the circumference. Twenty-four pi divided by twelve, and that will be two pi. And the last one we have is angle DAC, which is this angle right here and if you remember BC is the diagonal so this angle here has to be 120 degrees because that's the one that is supplementary of this 60 degrees so uh, the length of arc DC will be the same with the one of BE because those angles both of them are 120 so it's going to be 8 pi so that's it for this problem of course you can use proportion if you want uh, however when the angle are friendly i think using this idea of a fraction of the circumference work faster if you enjoyed this video clip don't forget to click the like button and come back on c square for more help thank you